Hi, in today's Mac tip, I'm going to show you how to make a header row in your Excel file. Now, most of the time, people figure out that they don't have header rows when they go up to data and sort, and they see in the sort field, which is where you have to select what, what you know column you want to sort, it shows up column A, B, and C instead of the actual name that's on there. So um, with that being said, this is how you can put one in. There's many different ways of putting one in, but this one is my favorite, So, um, and it's quick and easy. You just click on the upper left little uh, triangle here, which selects everything. Then you go back up to Data. You click Sort. And right up here, I don't know if you noticed it, there was a little checkbox that said, My list has headers. Check on that. Soon as you check on that, you're going to get your choices. And let's say you want to sort by um, the second column, which is date or the name. You can click that and hit OK. Now, once you've done that, that becomes your header row right here. And if you go to data and you click sort, and you always have to select all when you do that, you're going to see them each time. So that's all there is to it, and you can sort by whichever column you want and make your choices, um, leaving as you're sorting that column to the top. Well, that's all there is to it. Uh, thanks for listening. If you like the video, please subscribe to the channel and put a like on the video. If uh, you are looking for some more Excel tips in the future, I'll be posting them soon.